Hi guys, it's Amy from Amy Valentine and this is my Jeffrey Campbell Spike Lee Tear Shoe unboxing video. That's a mouthful. I'm going to try and film this while it's still light-ish, so if the light kind of changes, apologies for that. Um, I recently went to London for Salmon International and um, I needed to get a pair of black shoes and I didn't bring any with me because I, I wasn't aware before I was in London. And um, I've been wanting to buy the Jeffrey Campbells for ages anyway, so when I got, uh, it was just a, basically a chance for me to buy them, so I did. I got them for maybe around £100 um, because they were going for 120 in Urban Outfitters and um, at the moment, I don't know if it's still on, but there was a student discount, like 20% off student discount, so I used that to buy them with because I have a student an NUS card and I also bought some other stuff so it kind of brought it down a bit. This is the box, typical like Jeffrey Campbell, um, the kitty jumper box. And the shoes are really well packaged like this. Um, when I was in the shop, there was a pair out, but they were literally just like fl shoes floating around in the box. And if I was going to pay that much money for them, I'd rather have them brand new with all the packaging. So um, I got the um, shop assistant to go and g get me a pair of brand new. So and I'm happy I did that because the they'd been obviously been worn so there was kind of like bits where someone had like put the spikes into the side of the shoe like stuff like that so um yeah if you're going to go get a pair get a brand new unopened pair because it's worth it so they come in like a big shoe bag and when you open it there is um like there's like a, a shoe fleece and um, because the spikes are really sharp take off the skirt tape and there it is. I've got, I've worn mine. Um, I wore mine for like most of the weekend that I bought them because obviously I had to wear them for the fashion shows. Um, so but like there's hardly any damage apart from kind of you might not be able to see it just where the, I've kind of caught the shoe with the spikes from the other shoe. But um, otherwise like the sole is totally fine. This pair, this shoe actually, I stood on a hair clip. So there's like. A kind of two tiny lacerations but like otherwise it's fine they also come with this dip load of tissue kind of stuffed in them um, so that's always good to have I guess the spikes are ridiculously spiky um, it's actually like comes to a trouble when taking the shoe off so you have to kind of just choose the domey spikes rather than the spiky spikes um, to pull them off with. So far I haven't actually lost any spikes yet but um, th apparently people are saying that they are they come off easier than you think but this box actually comes with extra spikes in case that does happen which I think you just screw in I don't know I, I don't know how they put them in um, but they are uh, the true to size I think um, I, I got seven I am seven and they fit me fine they are I, I don't know like everybody says that they're super comfortable to walk around in I do find them a lot more comfortable than my other shoes and I can walk in them fine but when I was walking around at the shows like at Salon International I did find that they were hurting my feet I'm not sure if this is because I'd worn them straight out of the box and I hadn't broken them in yet or because they are just generally uncomfortable but I didn't I couldn't personally wear them for a whole day without my feet hurting Another thing that I don't really like is the gap between the shoe, like the spikes on the top part of the shoe and the spikes on the heel, like there is quite a large gap. Like when you're wearing them kind of from afar, you can't see it obviously not nearly as much, but um, I really kind of, it is a, a bit of a niggly thing that annoys me. Unfortunately, um, when you're walking, the shoes do like you, you can do sometimes catch the other shoe on the leather so I have a feeling that the leather will eventually get damaged um, if you wear them like quite a lot because the spikes are really lethal um, so that is a downside of the leather that's why I think the suede would be good but then again the, the damage would only be on the inside of the shoe so it's not really a very open thing but um, you can definitely you could definitely injure someone with these. It's like if you go clubbing or something, like you would hurt someone if you kicked them out or something. So yeah, um, I'll give you a little snippet of me walking around. Thank 
you for watching my Jennifer Campbell shoe unboxing. I hope you liked it. I hope I didn't burble on for too long. Subscribe to me and follow me on Tumblr, Instagram at amyvantinex. And as always, catch up with me on my blog at amyvantinex.blogspot.com. Bye!